All right. This is the brother Kaya. Uh, once again, I'm coming at you with another sit down. And uh, prior to getting started, I want to say Baraka Tayahawa, Baraka Tayahawa Shah, Baraka Tayahawa, Baraka Tayahawa Shah, Baraka Tayahawa, Baraka Tayahawa Shah, by Shimmer Kakodash. The bonds to the elders and the pies is a great millstone. And uh, <clears throat> peace and salutation to them. To, to those arguments out here pushing the truth and society and to the true I can push on, man. And um <clears throat> I wanted to just lay back off the um the energy and the vibe that's been going around Israel lately, man. Just uh uh why we call you the devil, man. And um justifiably so, man, because <clears throat> a lot of brothers doing um doing uh videos on this topic, man, and, and just in general. But uh, you know, is 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 it'll be infinite amount of videos that come out, man. We ain't gonna. It's not enough scriptures to show how you the devil, man. The entire book shows how you the devil, man. And with no further ado, I'm gonna dive right into it, man. And the first one I'm gonna get is uh, is uh Psalms, and I'm gonna just. You know, I'm going to just go through it. I mean, I ain't really got it in order, but I'm going to just go through it as I got it. It's Psalms 137 and 7, and it reads, it says, Remember, O Yahweh, the children of Edom and the day of Jerusalem. And the children of Edom is who, man? That's Esau, man. That's that curse of Cain that came back down through Esau, man. Edom. Today is be known as the so-called white man, man. Amalek, man. Being a chief family. It says who said race it, race it, even to the foundations thereof, man. Raise the heat up on these on, on these uh people, man. You know? Fuck over them even more, man. Cause they have only had one consent. Since they, they came up out of the own, um, we came up out of the land of Egypt, man. Is the what? The straws as a whole, man. <clears throat> this Psalms 83 and all uh, three. It says, they have taken crafty counsel against thy people and consulted against thy hidden ones. They have said, come and let us cut them off from being a nation that the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance, man. For they have consulted together with one consent. They are confederate against thee. Y'all hate the 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 y'all hate the sons of God, man, who he have deemed to be his own, who to be in his image, man. His representation of him himself, man, through these people, man, on the planet Earth, man. Y'all have chosen to raise the sword up up against him, man. And on um, and not and have not put your sword down, man. That's why blood on um, break it out and touch it blood, man. So blood gonna pursue you, man. It says the tabernacles of Edom, first and foremost, man. This is why you the devil, man. And all your little compadres that come with it, the Ishmaelites, Moab. Hagarines, Gabriel, Ammon, right? Amalek, the Philistines, the Tyree, all these people, man. But chiefly Edom is what we we uh this 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 video is based upon, man. It's strictly pointing out the residue of the heathen, man. The things that the heathen have dis displayed to chief chiefly Edom, man. This uh Proverbs 1 and 12, and it reads, it says, let us swallow them up alive as the grave, man. These people have, we done been low to the flow as we could go, man. And you know what these people did, man? Continuously kicked us when we down. Like the most I said, man, I own. Um, I was but a little, yet, but a little displeased, man. Let me get that.
This Zechariah 1 and 15, it says, And I am very sore displeased with the heathen that are at ease. For I was but a little displeased, and they helped forward the affliction, man. They went above and beyond what the Most High allowed them to do, man, to be their whooping stick, man. They continued and forward the punishment, man, when the Lord didn't tell them to do that, man. And this just this been since the beginning that they've been feeling like this, man. Ever since the birthright issue, man. This Genesis 27 and 41, I'm going to get straight to the point. It says, and Esau hated Jacob. Esau, so-called white man, right? The devil. Why we call him the devil. And Esau hated Jacob because of the blessing wherewith his father blessed him. Jealousy, man. And Esau said in his heart. In his mind, the days of my morning, of mourning for my father are at hand. Then will I slay my brother Jacob, man. This man's mindset have never changed from that, man. He's still a vagabond in the earth, man, running around, just trying to, uh, uh, they sit up day and night, man, on their beds, man, to contemplate how to keep Jake oppressed, man. With a strong arm, man. He stay up night, man. He drive away sleep, man. Trying to figure out how to um, constantly just uh, do evil and wicked deeds to the children of Israel, man. And who I'm speaking about is Esau, the devil. And if this ain't proof, then you know. Produce your cause, man. Show your strong reasoning. To say it otherwise, if it's not, if it's not you, then who is it? This Deuteronomy 25 and 17, and it reads, it says, remember what Amalek did unto thee by the way? Amalek is the chief family of Edom, man. When we were come forth out of Egypt, let's see what they did. How he met thee by the way, and that he that we speaking about right here is talking about what? Uh, uh, Jacob and Esau, man. It says, <clears throat> when he met thee by the way and smote the hindmost of thee, even all that were feeble behind thee, even the weak he killed them, man. When thou was faint and weary and he feared not God. It says, therefore shall be when Yahweh thy God had given thee rest from all thy enemies round about in a land which Yahweh thy power giveth thee for inheritance to possess it. That thou shalt blot out the remembrance of Amalek from under heaven. Thou shalt not forget it. They, they going the father going to uh, blot the, uh, <clears throat> these people inheritance completely out, man. From under the heavens, man. For these atrocities that they done done unto the children of Israel, man. The father haven't forgotten it, man. This Obadiah one. And 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 you gon and you gonna get this work, man. Cause you know it's gonna be more precepts, brother, come out, but it's gonna be some main ones that brothers are basically touching on that's really uh that's really a, a good representation of, of 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 how you have treated the, the children of Israel, man, and the earth, man, and still doing it to this day. You guilty, man. You caught red handed. You know how they call the devil got caught red handed, man. This Obadiah 1 and 10, it says, For thy violence against thy brother Jacob, shame shall cover thee, man, and thou shalt be cut off forever. Like you say, you, you're not going to have no remembrance in the earth, man. It says, In the day that thou stood is on the other side, in the day that the strangers carried away captive his forces, and foreigners enter into his gates, and cast lots upon Jerusalem, you sold the children of Israel, you stole them, then sold them, man. Even thou was as one of them. You sold us to the heathens, man. It says, but thou should have not looked on the day of thy brother in the day that he became a stranger. Neither should have thou have rejoiced over the children of Judah in the day of their destruction. Neither should have thou have spoken proudly in the day of distress. And the scriptures tell you, man, to <clears throat> forgive your brother seven times 70, man. So we know you broke that brotherly covenant, man. 
It says, thou should have not entered into the gate of my people in the day of their calamity, man. Yea, thou should have not have looked on their affliction in the day of their calamity, nor have laid hands on their substance in the day of their calamity, man. You guilt this charge, man. When a judge being Yahweh by Shem, Yahweh shot, drop the gavel, man, and they find you guilty, man. Man, Esau gonna fall out and die, man. Once he get once we once this verdict get read to him, and what his own um, judgment gonna be, Esau gonna die before he even get on the field, man. Before he start to even serve his sentence out, man. Or his judgment out. That's how brutal it's gonna be. Cause this man pride deceive him, man. This is Isaiah 14. In 13, it says, For thou hast said in thine heart, I will ascend into heaven, I will exalt my throne above the stars of God. Whoo! <laughs> I will sit also upon a mount of the congregation in the size of the north, which is the daughter of Babylon. It says, I will ascend above the heights of the clouds. I will be like the most high, man. Man, that's blasphemy, man. That's great swelling words, man. You, this devil. Them blaspheme the name of the Lord. Man, this, man, bro. This is why we call you the devil, man. Diablos, deceiver, man. It's you. You ain't cast but a friendly ghost, man. You've been exposed, man. The lights is on on this devil, man. That darkness is exposed. But like you said, uh... This Daniel 7 and 25, it says, and he shall speak great words against the most high, man. Blaspheme. Who, who have done that, man? What, what do you what do Edom have to do with the laws, statutes, and commandments, man? He didn't wrote of uh, uh unrighteous decrees, man, and grievances, man. That's just that just upholding all wickedness in society, man. This man gotta be put down. It says, and shall wear out the saints of the Most High. He didn't wear out the saints of the Most High, man. Which means what? The holy ones, man. And think to change the times and laws. This man had changed the times and laws, man. He didn't done away with the law, the Father. He didn't broke the everlasting covenants, man. And they shall be given unto him into his hand a time and a times and a dividing of the times, man. Which Double days, Bushard, man. That's them three and a half days, man. It says, but the judgment shall sit and they shall take away his dominion to consume and destroy it until the end, man. So, hey, your day is numbered, man. The father the number your days, man, and you the devil, man. You know? So, I just wanted to um add to the bottom, man, to the argument, man. You know, we're bringing out and, and, and confound this devil, man. You know? And this is why we call you the devil, man. But with that, I come on and give infinite honors and prayers to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah. Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. And uh, peace and salutation to the Akim that's pushing out channel truth and sincerity. And to the true Akim, push on. And until the next time, I won't see. Shalom.